I am Curly Sue and today is day 12 I think oh yes day 12 of vlogmas no today is day 13 of vlogmas so today I'm going to show you how to wrap a present um, so let's get started the presents that I'm going to wrap today are this and this so you can see these two are kind of irregular shapes so wrapping them with wrapping paper is going to be a little bit of a challenge but we'll come to those shortly I'll show you how to cope with that and this is another present that is in a regular shape as well that won't wrap as nicely with just paper but there is a way around it and I also have this that I'm going to wrap and this. So we have a number of different um, things we're going to wrap today, but we're going to start off with the easy one first. Anything flat and square, anything square really is really easy to wrap. So first of all, you need to, a sheet of wrapping paper that is, let me take it back a bit so you can see a bit more. I think that's as much as I can do. So you need the wrapping paper to be a bit bigger, obviously, than your gift. So what you need to do is have enough paper so that when you fold it over like that, the two ends meet roughly in the middle of your gift. So measure out the paper in that way. So all you do is bring this in tightly around one side and then bring the other side in hold it down and then just put a piece of sellotape there to secure that then for the sides you want to make sure you haven't got too much paper on each side you only want about two inches so we're going to cut some off on this side and the same on the other side because it will give it a much need to finish because the idea is to wrap it with as little paper as possible so that it doesn't look too bulky and messy. We want it to look smooth and nice and professional looking. So then you turn in the corners like so, and then, so it brings, makes it into a peak. And then again, secure it with a piece of sellotape, making sure everything's nice and flat. And you do the same on the other side. Fold in one corner like that. And then the other corner like this. Making sure you tuck everything in tightly. And then bring it over. And sellotape to, whoops. Gives on the other side of falling. And then you can see it looks nice and professional here and smooth. Now we need some ribbon. Now the different types of, let me just show you the ribbons and bows that I have. I have these different types of bows. So you can have these types of bows. Got some glittery ones here and some regular bows here. So ribbon, you can have curling ribbon and we're gonna use some of that today. And I've got this really pretty ribbon that I bought, actually bought this from the pound shop. Um, really lovely and it was in like the sewing section where you get all kind of sewing bits and I've also got this kind of see-through ribbon as well and I've also got a couple of gift bags and also some I've got a whole roll of this wrapping paper and the essential sellotape and scissors so We've wrapped this one, but we need to put some ribbon on it. So, what you can do here is get a length of ribbon that's probably about a metre of ribbon. So cut off about a metre of ribbon. And you're going to wrap it around the present like so, twist it and then come back around to the front like so 
and then press it down gently and then this is when you need to keep your finger there and you just need a little piece of sellotape I've got a big piece here so let me just cut it so just a little piece of sellotape like about this much um, probably even less than this we're going to use half of this so it's just enough to secure the ribbon like so there you go just to hold it down and then we're going to put our bow in the middle so these peel off I'm sure many people know you peel it off but this video is just in case you don't know um, so Peel it off, it can be a little bit fiddly, so you'll need your nails for this one. Pull that off and stick that right in the middle. Doesn't that look lovely? And then you're going to open your scissors like so, and the non shiny side of the ribbon, just turn it around. You're going to pull, hold one end of the ribbon and pull it the bow like that and that curls the curl there and you do the same with the other side hold one end of the ribbon and like that and there you have one pretty wrapped gift and on the back you can adjust it if you like turn that over it's perfectly fine flatten it down you don't want to fiddle with it too much and that's gift one that's wrapped now Gifts that are more difficult to wrap are, for example, this is round. So that's more difficult to do. So I have the perfect solution for wrapping a gift like this. You just get a gift bag and pop it in your gift bag and that's it, it's done. And what you can do is just put a nice bow on the front of your gift bag and that's it, you're done. So that's the best thing to do with irregular shaped gifts. So I'm going to do one more. Oh yeah, we've got this gift. Now say if you don't have a gift bag, but you still need to wrap something like this. I'm gonna show you how to do that. What you need to do is wrap the present in such a way, I'm just gonna cut some wrapping paper for this one just measure it yeah you need to wrap the present in such a way so it kind of forms a kind of a pocket so let me just cut out some of this just do that some people tear the wrapping paper you can if you want to but it's Depending on the paper, it's not always a good idea. So we have our wrapping paper and we have our irregular shaped gift in the middle. So what you want to do is, again, make sure the two halves meet in the middle. Get it as straight as possible. Now, as you can see, you're not sure if you can see on the camera, this edge is not very straight. It doesn't look that wonderful. So all you do, is fold it over so that it, the jagged edge, kind of messy looking edge, is underneath, and voila. That's done, so you just need a piece of cellar tape for that. Now, for the edges, what we're going to do is not fold it all the way in, is just make a kind of a pocket. So, just turn it around here. So what we're going to do is fold it like this. And then fold it over. That needs a trim, so let me trim that first of all. Yeah, so if it looks like this, I'm just trim it nice and neat so again just 
fold it over and fold it over again. There you go. So that's a nice neat edge. And we just need a piece of sellotape for that. Just hold it down with a piece of sellotape here. Now if there's a little non-decorated bit, you just fold it underneath. So that's one side done. We need an extra piece of sellotape there. Um, need another tiny bit more. So that's how the first side looks. So you'd never believe there's a regular shape present in there, would you? And then you do the same on the other side. So fold it over, fold it over again, and then you just tuck it in like so. And then you just need a piece of sellotape to hold it down. I need a piece more of sellotape. Right. So you press it down all the way across. And there you have your wrapped present. So this was the heart-shaped tin present. But we want to decorate it a bit more, so we can put a bow in the middle, like so. But this bow doesn't stick, so what we could do... Um, I don't think the red goes with it. So I think we can use some of this one. So again, you need about a metre. So just cut a metre of ribbon roughly and then wrap it right around your present mm, yeah so wrap it all the way around and then you're going to fix that with a piece of sellotape any little messy bits, you just tuck them underneath. And, yep, yeah, just put the piece across like that. And when you turn it over, so you've got your bow like that. And we need another piece going across. I didn't make it long enough to go across as well, so I can just fix that by just cutting another piece and going across like so. And there. And a piece of sellotape for that. we could can use this one because this one has like a little tie thing on here and what we can do is fix it to the ribbon quite easily so that it makes sure you do it really well so it doesn't fall off one pretty present check us out there you go so that's how you wrap presents if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it the thumbs up <laughs> trying to do it with the camera at a different angle give it the thumbs up there yeah, that's it give it the thumbs up um, in the section down below don't forget to click and subscribe um, this is part of my vlogmas vlogging um, vlogmas videos so i'm doing a video every every single day for the month of december um, don't forget to click and subscribe and don't forget to share this video wherever you are on social media 
How do you wrap presents? Got any hints and tips? Tell me in the comment section below. I'll be on again tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.